Hello there, welcome back to another episode of this Dale campaign with me, Suzavile, and, well, I'm going to regroup some units. I think I'm going to fight this army with, actually, this one. But I need some cavalry on this army, actually. Well, why I'm going to use this one? Well, it's it's simple. I do want this general. I think this general is quite good. It's an 8 uh, command general. Um, and another thing is that there's so much... There's, there's a lot of catapults there, and I want to use some baiting units, like Half Watchmen I don't mind losing to catapults, you know. So what I was thinking was that uh, that's low quality troops, and even the best quality troops he has, it's, it's like no big deal. Like all traders are nothing. So this is what I'm thinking, I'm thinking of using this army, but I need some cavalry. That's what I'm gonna need, I need some cavalry. So I'm going to take away a few units, like this, the worst units that they have. Yeah, something like this. Actually, the Hearth Watchman taking away... No, I'm going to take away the Barding here. Yeah, I'm going to use the Dismounted Earls and the All Swords Masters. Well, I do need a few good troops there. So now I have four armies. And can I send in my cavalry? I cannot. Well, luckily... So doesn't he. So does he. He can't move there. So I'm going to move my cavalry over here. Do I have any cavalry extra? Yes. I'm thinking I'm going to need about three units of cavalry. So I got to do this. Send that in. I'm just making the right composition for the right engagement, you know. One, two, three, four, five, six units. Of archers plus two ballistas, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven units of infantry. I'm gonna trade the rivermen for what an extra unit of infantry, probably some dalesmen or some dale swordsmen. Some dale swordsmen, I do need a little bit of good quality troops. So, yeah. Uh, I can have another unit, so I'm gonna have one unit of dales. Yeah, that's it. That's good. Uh, on this end, I'm going to take away the, the, the bad units. Like, the, Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. One unit of archers, because I do believe that's, that's too many archers, I think. So let's take these units away. Oh, I did want that body cured over there. Let's give him one body cutting here. Another one. It's on its way. Let's move them closer. What do we have here? Merge. Okay, for King Bard. Some Dalesman? I think he needs a lot of more infantry. Oh, this parting here. It's gonna stay here. So I'm gonna have one, two units of parting here. Oh, and these guys. Where are you? That's it. You guys are going to join up with King Bard. And that's it. That's the biggest thing. I did move a lot of men during my last turn. I just make the, the small movements. I'm going to do them off camera, probably. Started building some troops here. Let me see. Uh, actually, not this. No, no need for that, no need for that. Thornburg, Mataram. Where's Mataram? Oh, it's right there. It's a large town. There's, I think there's no way that Mataram is ever going to produce good quality units. Okay, two crop rotations. That's, <laughs> that's the best I could hope for. Okay. How are things here? Yeah, just attack that small army. Fight it off. It's getting interesting the, the way that Mordor is fighting on two fronts. He's fighting against Gondor. Rohan is not not important anymore. But he's fighting against Gondor and he's trying to fight against me and I think he should uh, he should be doing better. And no, he's Unit just losing to everything. I forgot to take away the weather. That was a mistake. 
I only have one ballista? Oh, I thought I thought I had two. I always like to have them on, on pairs. Yeah, it just feels better, I believe. I'm gonna leave these guys protecting the ballista. Because if they die, I don't care. That's that's exactly I don't care about those units. These are low quality units, they they were good against Rune early on, but now they're just liability. Oh, I do have one good unit here. This is not a good army, but he has a, a great uh, general. And at least it's balanced out. That's what I feel. It's quite balanced out. Uh, cavalry is going to be on this side. And you, sirs, you're going to be on this flank as well. So that's it. Can my ballista hit them? No, it can't. So let's just move it closer. Oh, the, it should hit them, but for some reason they are not. Run in, run in. These are these are so these are so so many missile troops on this flank that anything he he uses to charge there will will reach there with nothing actually. Uh, no one has flaming arrows. That's good. Okay. Yeah, destroy that Moranon Guard. And another unit of Moranon Guard. There's some ore craters. Yeah. Poor, poor Mordor. He has heavy infantry and a lot of men, but I, I don't know why he just loses a lot. I don't know why why people think Mordor is, is tough. I think most of them... It's probably had. It probably has to do with their numbers, but they they usually don't have a lot of generals. Only when the uh, the Nazgul appear, then they are quite powerful. Okay, let's run them in. Okay, my ballista is hitting. Run them over. Run my flank. That's it. He says gonna go over there and on their backs. That's it, ballista firing. Good. Now my archers start firing. Hit them! Come on. Oh, my ballista are missing. At least my archers appear to be doing well. I usually go forward with my infantry when they are quite close, like this. That's what I'm gonna do. So they are charging at my archers, but my archers will never stop firing, actually. I may get some friendly fire, but the effect on them is that they, al they will actually face my troops when they were not expecting that. Come on, send everyone in. Let's clear things up for you. Good! Okay, you boys stop. And each unit just attack this one. If you can. Come on, just stop it. Let's see the f effect of javelins. It's just too many javelins. And they are on a hill. This guy, there's no way he's gonna do anything. Come on, here we go. 160 and then they are... 120. <laughs> Quite shaken already. Uh, you stop. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Okay, let's see what's happening. Fire them off. That's it. These guys will probably... They're fighting, but they will start routing. Broken, of course. There's just no, no... No way they're going to do anything. Oh, my archers were attacking. I don't know why. Oh, they are actually fighting! 
Damn. They had regrouped. Send one unit over there. Can you strike them? Yeah, you can. You can't. Where are his armies? Come on. These ones are routing. These ones will rout. These ones are nothing to be afraid of. These are the only units that remain. They won't be steady for long. I'm gonna actually attack them. They're gonna stop firing that longbowman unit that I told them. My hearth watchman will engage them and that should be enough. They won't like to see all their their men the dying and the charge from the rear. It should go to yellow, then red in the morale. Charge! That's it. The enemy army Done. The Pursue and run them down. Okay, faster time. I want my horsemen to kill as many as they can. Good. I think it's enough. They will rout. This is a clear Quite victory. a clear victory right there. That was good. And I gained some experience with my... Uh, with my general. That's always good. Hmm. <laughs> so the back entrance to Mordor is done. Okay, let's... Oh, I got a lot of stuff. Merge my units. Send them in. Keep moving. Retinue, I got a blade and I got plus one command. Now this guy's... Now this guy really means business. Ooh. Okay. I'm thinking, can he reach the bridge before me? No, he can't actually. So I'm thinking of holding up the bridge. Hopefully I can manage that. Let's do this small trick of having my spy over there. <laughs> Okay, now it's going to be interesting. He's sending a huge army over here. The good thing is that he's sending this one here, and that means that he's not reinforcing the front. So that's a good thing. Okay, I have my army prepared here. Yes. Your orders, my lord. This guy is not prepared. Yes, my lord. Uh, you shall join in. Okay, let's merge everyone. Your will, my lord. Merge over here. The next time I'm going to take all those units. Who's the better general? This one or this one? This one. Okay. So this guy is going to fall with everything that it's full strength over here. Anything that it's full strength. Even those... Well, woodsmen, I should... I should not use woodsmen for now. Yeah. I think it's time to start disbanding a few troops. Especially those that are not actually anything of importance right now. I could make a, 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 a unit just with the bad guys, you know. Do need some Dalesmen over there. Keep recruiting Dalesmen. Yes, my lord. Okay, two units that he's going to get from here, plus other two units or one unit, maybe, and then one cavalry unit when I have that battle. Yeah, that's it. Did I move everything else? Order. Yeah, it appears so. Will, it appears so. Order. I don't want to miss anything, actually. Will, Diplomat! Where are you? Yes, my lord. It did yes, miss. My lord. So, here we go! Now it's, it's really a two-front war. I can't... Uh, I can't uh, lose that army on the... The other front, because if I lose it, <laughs> I'll have no way to defend. Actually, if I lose on the back entrance, that would be really bad. Hopefully, I won't. Elves of Lorien, what do you want? Nothing. They didn't want anything. Okay, Mordor didn't attack. That's a good thing. Isengard is not on my spots. Dunland, Orcs of Gundabad. 
Harad. I'm not afraid that Harad will attack me, actually, and that's a bad thing. If they do so, uh, it's going to be a, it's going to become a, a longer campaign immediately. Okay, my diplomat is selected. That's good. Okay, this is interesting. The free peoples of Eriador are at war with the dwarves. Would you prefer it were the aggressor? Okay, I don't want. So if I decline, I still get allied with the dwarves, right? Yep. That's it, right? Yes, that's it. That's, that's better. Without question. Yeah, that's a high elf family member. I think the high elves, high elves are getting good. End of turn, construction, port. Oh! oh ho, 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 ho. Couldn't be at a better time. Earls. Mounted earls. Damn it, it's, it's immediately. They cost 960, that's not a lot. And one unit of Athal Rangers or Dale Cavalry. I do need my cavalry there. So yeah, and Esgaroth it's going to build, but it's it's almost finished in, in terms of what it can build. So it's time to build the, the good buildings, the good marketing buildings. So yeah, the shipwright, that will make it better. Rovanost can build a gravel road, yeah, that will be good. Can build a market, I'm sorry. And Dol Guldur, what can you recruit? Not anything as of yet. And you do have 32, so it's gaining 2%. Uh. Well, it's going to take a, a, a while, but I guess it's okay. Esgaroth has done everything. Uldunavan. Hmm. Not Uldunavan, actually. Thornburg. You're going to keep building small units. Like Hoth, Watchmen, all that jazz. Actually, retrain that unit. That's good. And the... The Oaken Shield guys. Yeah. Okay, so where's that army? There it is. Is there any surprises on this? Okay, one big army over here. Over there, they didn't manage to go there. That's yes, good. I'm gonna hold on the bridge and hope that he actually doesn't go with anything around here. I'm gonna have to check around. Okay, hopefully he won't manage to, to get too many armies over here. Let me check. Yeah, I think I can manage that that army over there. Is Harad moving anything? It doesn't look like. Your orders. Yes. Keep sending that diplomat away. Actually, I'm just going to reinforce a little bit here. Uh, not that. That's it. I don't want any good bad surprises over there. So, yep. Keep moving my men. Come on. Ah, the scroll, it's so weak. I'm gonna merge these, these troops because... Well, I don't want to have to move too many armies at once. Like, that's better. Go over to Raw and retrain. Why oh, can't retrain? Is it because of the money? No, not 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 enough available units. Salesman, get on with it. You sir, move in. Close up. These guys are gonna move in with King Bart. Bottom bird, come on. We can go no further oh, come today, on. My lord. Okay, here we go. One unit of body in here. Yeah. Well, that is interesting. Merge, actually, let's join in everything that it's not merged. I think this guy is gonna go to Dale. To, uh, to guard. One, two, three. I want this unit to be really effective against anything that Mordor can send at us. 
So, yeah, I guess that's the idea. And I have both of these guys and then one Del Cavalry, yes. so it's everything there. And I can start to build another one. So this army is going to merge with that one, actually. So this, these guys are actually, there's no way I can retrain them, so let's just merge. That's it. Okay, this guy is going to move up here. Merge units. I don't need to merge a lot of units. Mm-hmm. Move there. If this is a small force. I think I can have more units there. Let's just merge. Okay. Let's go. To battle. Let's control save because sometimes it bugs out. Oh, I couldn't. Hopefully he will be able to do so. And he will attack me. Let's have this spy over here. This spy is quite good over there. But I think I can move over here for not so... So that I can't be surprised, actually. Let's try to find out that mortar army. Where is it? Ah, it's not over here. It's actually not over here. I wonder. Oh, there it is. It's coming against me. I moved my diplomat. Yes. Okay, no battle for now. King Bard can move in closer. Can he attack? No, he can't. Let's move in these guys. Then after the battle, I'll give him some cavalry. Yes, this no. guy's done for it, so end the turn. Oh, I forgot one unit. Yep, a lot of micromanagement, as you can see, whenever you have to fight so many armies of Mordor. I'm thinking that two, three more um, armies, uh, more, three more full packs of Mordor armies, and I'll be fine. If I can destroy all of those, then I'm going to start conquering his lands and he won't have a chance. Hopefully, Dol Guldur will start producing back, uh, um, at that moment. And here we go. So I guess you're going to have your one hour special. <laughs> okay, that's... that's good. He only has one unit of Uruks and one unit, two units of Moran guards. One of them is heavily damaged. So all of the, all of what matters is the catapults. He doesn't even have archers or anything. Yeah, no archers whatsoever. So I'm feeling confident on this one. Feeling quite confident on this one. So after the battle, I'll take a rest, make a pause, and. I hope you guys will enjoy this one. Our foes appear to be gaining the upper hand in this Really? Battle. He thinks that? Unit, okay. My so I could use some good weather, which he denied, but I do have a good field of battle. Like I have a small place. Yeah, I have a small edge over here. That's what I'm going to use. Uh, my ballistas. I'm going to have them on one flank. So that they can actually fire off pretty easily. Okay, on top of the hill. This way they're not hampered on their shots. You should notice those stuff. Now, cavalry. That's an easy one. Actually, not group in one. I don't want group one there. I want archers grouped as two. Over here. Units now. I'm thinking a weak uh, center and a strong... Well, I'm, I can do two lines, actually. Like Dalesman, Swordsman on the, on the middle. Or Dalesman on the middle. Uh, I think Swordsman in the middle. That's it. Something like this. Group up. Uh, put yourselves together, man. And these two units on reserve for any place 
that he tries to attack. And my cavalry. You are going... Okay, my Dale cavalry actually is going to go on this side. Because I need to flank them immediately. As far away as you can, boys. Come on, as far away as you can. My ballista will be able to hit his... Um, I gotta take his... The fryer. Yeah. Because if they are able to hit my... Uh, his... Uh, how to say? Uh, his artillery, then it's fine. Start the battle. Show them to me. Okay, there's a, that's a lot of catapults, actually. There's no troll catapults. They don't seem troll catapults. These are basic catapults, right? Yeah. Okay. He's actually playing it well. He's protecting the siege weapons. Oops. Take away the skirmish. If you don't, he'll he'll always use it to his advantage. Okay, men. Difficult to see it is. Okay, let's start moving my Dale Cavalry in their backs. Run. That's it. If I can take at least some of his uh, catapults out of the way. One, two, three, four. And I have three units of cavalry. Probably I can take one, maybe two. Why are my guys not firing? Oh, now they are. That's good. He's trying to move faster. He can run with his catapults. That's so bad. That's badass right there. Okay, let's see his troop movements. My archers are going to start firing right now, probably. Okay, he did send his, caver his catapults to the front. I don't know why. Okay. Okay, fired will over there. Send against the catapults. He's protecting over here, actually. Ah, so much catapult fire. They can't miss all of them. Jesus, that was a lot of men. Okay. Guess I gotta rush in. Rush in those men, otherwise they're gonna die. My archers are fine, I think. Wow, that was a huge hit. Come on. Get to that catapult. Not your craters. Kill the catapult. Come on. That's it. He says, move in. Damn catapults. So how are my guys doing? Did they manage to hit one of them? No, they didn't. Get the hell out of there. Get the hell out of there, humans. Get the hell out of there. Come on. They, de they managed to hit them, but not as I wanted them to do so. Okay, this mounted earls and my two Dale swordsmen, swordmasters, they're gonna do a lot of damage there. You! Hit that catapult! Hit that one! And you're taking them for a walk. That's it. Actually, take this one. These are Orc Raiders. They're not that good. Archers are doing fine. Yusa is going to stop in auto fire as well as you can. Okay, did I manage? At least they're not firing their catapults, which is the, the thing that I wanted. They do need the cavalry to do so. Mm. 
as you've noticed. Okay, archers are in the middle. It appears to be gaining the upper hand. I'm gonna attack here. I've realized that actually I shouldn't be able to do this. Actually, let's do like this. Attack on the other side, shall we? Where are the catapults? Over here, they were destroyed. Yeah, that's it. So attack over here. That's it. Rally your troops, sir. Okay, I'm managing to attack over here. That makes them waver. Broken. Immediately, sirs. Go and attack over here. Keep fighting them. How are the catapults going? Not well. Managing to attack them over here. That's good. I knew that I would lose a lot of troops, but I was hoping for a little bit better results. Okay, let's start destroying their morale. Waver, if I can cause a mass route, then it's it's done. Okay, get the hell out of there. Get the hell out of there. Good, mass routes everywhere. Dalesman attack the Orc Raiders. And you, attack over here. Only half the enemy force remains. That's it. That's it. They're almost all fleeing away. That's it. That's how I like to see it. Get the hell out. Yes, it is. Okay. Archers. I'm actually going to do this. Move my archers forward so they stop firing. And also they get in a better position. Who said Path Watchmen were bad? Come on. Okay, one charge on their backs should do it. These guys are pursuing, but they have nothing. Where are his catapults? Yeah, let's check those. And it's done! I can't believe it! It was just cause a mass rout with that unit of cavalry. That made it. Yeah, they're all routing. Just that Moran and Guard is not. So actually I'm gonna go into mass pursuit mode. Yeah, even with the with the longbowmen. That's it. Oh that was a nice victory. I lost 26% actually. Where are my other riders? There they are, those four craters. They're getting those Moranon gods. That's good, let's take away the... By the way, the only unit that is moving is that one. And I want it to stay here for a little bit. Because I want to be able to clear everything that I can. My god, this is going so well. Okay, Orc Raiders, stop! Shoot at them! Shoot, mates! Okay, that was scary in the beginning because of all those catapults, but if it wasn't for the cavalry, as you notice, the cavalry doesn't need to kill them. It just needs to keep them busy while you're fighting. Because they could easily have made it worse. Come on, fire over them! That's it, continue the battle! Fail cavalry attempts to destroy them. Keep pursuing them! That's it. My yeomen are doing a good job. These guys are not doing anything? Okay.
Yeah! Okay, it's time to fasten it up. Mop up. Mop up, gentlemen. Fire at will. Dismounted Earls. Dalesmen are pursuing these guys. Come on, let's get those. Now that's how a battle should be. Intense. <laughs> so hard to see on this landscape, actually. Who's over here? One catapult unit, actually. Gotta take them out. Let's stop these guys from firing. I don't want them to hit anyone else. Where are some units? These guys, okay. What else? What else? Nothing important. It's amazing that these guys had no experience when they started. <laughs> they managed to get to that catapult unit. Yes, I believe so. I think I can end for now. Yeah, pretty much. Ah, oh, that was a nice victory, don't you believe? All who remember this day, remember it as the day of our Four experience in one. Victory. That's because of, you know, almost 800 men killed. <laughs> uh, four experience in one, the others got one. I think it's good because I didn't lost... Uh, I didn't lost uh, my best units against this army, which is the, the main idea. It was the main idea, because I didn't want to lose... I, I just want to use my best units against his best units, like Olak High and the Mountain Trolls and uh, Nazgul's and stuff. So that was it. Uh -huh. And I'm gonna have this battle probably on the next episode. Yeah, I'm gonna make a pause here of the, the video, because it's getting way too long. So, I'll see you guys on the next video. I'll leave you with a cliffhanger. <laughs> Sorry, guys. See ya.